Right now, thousands of bridal shop owners are worried about the possible impact of the U.S.-China trade war. Tariffs could mean higher prices in the U.S. for things like silk. 41 Action News reporter Emma James gives us a closer look. With nearly 40 years of experience in the industry, the owner here at Nolte's Bridal in Overland Park has seen his fair share of wedding trends. And when it comes to the possibility of tariffs in the next couple of months, it's not something he's concerned about. I love my career and I have loved my career now for four decades. For Michael Nolte, helping a bride find a dress for her big day is an honor. It's an industry he loves, but right now he can't help but disagree with the latest headlines surrounding it. A quick Google search shows a handful of headlines saying the tariffs on Chinese products could be devastating for the bridal industry. I think that maybe they're just saying that to be a part of the bandwagon of the sky's falling in and we have a terrible administration and let's complain about everything today and be in a ruckus about it. This is absolutely not a ruckus. Because of the possible tariffs on items like silk, a Nashville dress designer is preparing to give bad news to her customers. I do what the customer wants. So if they want silk or something from China, I'm going to have to tell them, hey, because this is custom we're, and you know, with all the tariffs and everything, the cost is gonna be more. Nolte believes the tariffs likely won't happen, and if they do, the effect won't be felt on the entire industry. The reason I say that is because there already are so many other fabrics that have been used in bridal for years. Nolte believes most brides care more about a dress's silhouette rather than fabric. While he's not worried about tariffs affecting the cost of a dress, he does think a possible tariff on silk will motivate knockoffs. I'm sure that already they're making uh, cheap acetate copies of silk dresses. He wants to encourage brides to be vigilant about where they get their dress from. Something as personal as a bridal gown should never be ordered on the internet. In Overland Park, Emma James, 41 Action News.